everyone. So I have here a Facebook Marketplace haul. So I had ordered this actually um, a couple weeks ago and I just got around now to filming it. So basically these are, um, it's stuff that you can use inside, well, to make a junk journal. It's just a wide variety of um, pages that the seller had included. Actually, I didn't even know that there were these little pieces in here. Okay, so let's go ahead and go through it all, okay? She had paper clipped them, but I had already taken the paper clips off. Um, honestly, I don't know what the, this paper is for. It's It's got these cuts in it, and it's obviously for something, but I, I have no idea. Um, I might have to go back and look at the description. It's just kind of odd. If you know what it is, please let me know because I'm just curious. So let's put that to the side here. So like I said, there's various pages from books and magazines. So I've got here, it looks like this came from a, um, a book about birds. I've got some dictionary pages from a smaller dictionary. Um, this one looks like it's... Um, I have no idea. It looks like they're just probably a dictionary, but it's like, I don't know. It's just words that start with C. You've got, um, well, I have some old ads. Um, this is from the Etude from 1929. This is authentic. This is not reproduced, like copied. So I love stuff like this because, yeah, I love looking at the old ads and how much stuff was back then. Um, you have more pages from a book. This one is probably um, a law book because it's talking about different cases. For instance, I think this is probably from the state of Texas because it says here, night and state. Defendant was convicted of driving while intoxicated. From the judgment rendered by the county court, um, Nueces County, B.J. Moffitt, June, um, I guess J, I don't know, defendant appealed. The Court of Criminal Appeals, Morrison J, held that nothing was presented for review. Affirmed. Yeah, so that's pretty interesting. I don't think there are dates on these. Another page from the journal, um, the dictionary. And then I've got a color photo here. This might be from an interior design um, type of book because it's about carpeting and the different uh, rug fibers. Looks like this is from a comic book uh, called The Spirit Archives and it has Will Eisner at the bottom there. I've got the index to a book. Um, this is actually from that um, bird book because it has different species of birds. Um, again from that uh, interior book. Then I've got a very large print from um, a book. Um, this looks like it might be for um, an antique, like a, um, oh gosh, words escaping me here. But it's showing how much um, some of these that are pictured are worth. And then you've got ledger paper, more ads here. Um, this one does not say the year. Pink pages, hmm. Oh, from, this is from the Starbucks um, catalog. Anybody grow up looking and page marking toys in a Starbucks catalog? Raise your hand. <laughs> uh, this is from a magazine about artist dolls. And then we've got some um, music sheets here. I'm pretty sure there's more than just that one. Another one from that law book. Um, this one is now about synonyms and antonyms from the dictionary or thesaurus or I forget what it's called. Um, from another book. This one right here was obviously from like a, a book that was um, bound. Uh, this is like from Harris County and I'm pretty sure that this was probably a map book because you would look up the street name and then it would tell you and then it's showing the block and then the zip code. So it's probably also telling you where, you know, um, I might still have that. We've got this old map book that would show the entire county and it was kind of like that. I've got to find it. I know we still have it. Another uh, thesaurus kind of page. This is a recipe page. 
Um, got a music sheet here. I remember when I used to take piano lessons, my teacher would write out stuff for me to practice, which I hated. Um, page about stamps. And then more musical sheets. This one's pretty old from a magazine. Um, no, from a book. This is about contour drawings. Looks like it might be a coloring sheet. Another music page. Another page from a book. Um, see, now, I have a lot of old books and that I bought at a library sale. And I was thinking about maybe tearing, you know, tearing the books up to sell the pages, but I sure as hell would not tear the pages out like this. I would be at least very neat about it. Um, I've got an old ad here about, this is probably from like some gossip, movie mirror. There you go, gossip, you know, magazine. Um, this one, I don't know what this is from. Building blocks and construction toys, interesting. This one's pretty. It's February and it's got the um, recipe from a um, hymn book. Oh, this one was my favorite. Look at that. The um, different types of formal wear. Uh, and then you've got the different suits here. This one I'm not going to use because I really like that. I wish there was one for women. Um, I've got a picture of some dishes. Another... Uh, page from the gossip. Yeah, this one's got Clint Eastwood, Elizabeth Taylor, James Brolin, um, Thanos' father, for those who don't know, um, Joan Collins, John Wayne, Dick Cavett. Yeah, this is really old if it's got Dick Cavett on there. Um, another page from a book, another musical sheet, more book pages. This one is from a Bible. I don't I think I would tear up a Bible and use that. Um, this one is, I guess the, this was from a music book and we've got an old magazine page here. I'm not sure where it's from family medical information. So this was torn from some kind of a book, but it's definitely about military service. Um, this is probably like from an Atlas, maybe patterns and flows. Hmm. Another book, but I'm not sure. Look at that. It's so old. Um, it's probably like a Sunday roast or something. This one says walnut tart from elegant dinners. So we've got, really? She included this? <laughs> Don't know how that would make it in a junk journal. Um, yeah. Some of these I would definitely not need to use. I'd probably just chunk them. Uh, but I, I mean, I do like these type of things right here. The pages, the um, musical pages. Eh, some of these magazine ones are okay. Visual tour, discovery and travel. It's from an atlas. I like the recipe ones. More ledger paper. I do like the ledger paper, especially like this color, you know, looks worn. See, look at that. It's a cover from um, a hymn book, like really, really worn. Of course, it doesn't say um, the year or anything like that. And then we've got this, another sheet. More dictionary, more um, pages from a book. These are probably from, what are these? Buttons, I guess. It says 50 cents. Um, I have the bigger dictionary, so I don't really need stuff like that. Um, this is also from the recipe book. This one I like, because it's still from the um, Sears and Robux company. And then another of the currants. So yeah, I got this bundle for $9, I think. Um, and it came from, I want to say it came from Texas, but I'm not sure. I'd have to look at where's that envelope. It came from, yeah, from Texas. So, I mean, it's not bad. I was just curious to see what I could get from these type of, um, you know, 
um, sales. So this will probably be my last one unless it's something that's just really unusual. But at least I have an idea so that if I want to tear up a lot of the books that I bought from the library sales a, a couple of years ago, then I know how to bundle, you know, my stuff and then sell it. But I mean, I'm probably going to get around to start making my own junk journal. Um, I just have to decide on the cover and, you know, if there's going to be a theme or not, or it's just going to be a collection of just like random pages. So yeah, we'll see what, um, what happens. Okay. So <laughs> I do have a couple more hauls coming, um, coming up. Some of them I'm going to be, um, they're coming from online. So hopefully I will be able to get those posted. All right. So I hope everyone's having a good week. Bye.